ओ यारो हम ये इंडिया बुला लिया हो दीवानो हम ये इंडिया बुला लिया ये तो खेल है हो बड़ा मेल है हो अमीना दिया हो ये तो खेल है बड़ा मेल है हो अमीना October last year, it hit the ground running in order to get on with the preparatory work required for the live broadcast of an event as big as the Commonwealth Games. Starting in November 2009, several rounds of comprehensive venue surveys were conducted to concretize plans that were already on paper. Camera positions were identified and camera inclination angles standardized. At the same time, speciality camera equipment utilization was planned and final numbers confirmed. The venue surveys have been a consistent feature over the past seven months to nail down the minutest of details. First and last light calculations, including sun azimuth and shadow predictions, have been made in detail for all the venues. Teams have toured Delhi to research and confirm beauty camera locations that will appropriately showcase Delhi's history and culture during the actual games. Concurrently, the core production team identified venue production crews that would come in from around the world. Specialist and highly experienced commentary teams that will bring the 17 sports involved to life have also been sourced from Commonwealth countries and beyond. Besides the engineers and the teams on the ground, the creative heads have also been hard at work and a complete production plan was delivered to the host broadcaster, Prasar Bharti. A high-definition shoot and post-production facility has been in place in Delhi. And since November, regular monthly preview programs, news features and vignettes showcasing Delhi have been produced and delivered to the host broadcaster. Finally, interaction with the rights holding broadcasters has been an ongoing process.
We've been really pleased with what and Zoom have been able to do. Exceptionally trying circumstances, um, exceptionally difficult. I think we were buoyed some 12 months ago when we were told that that CIS and, and Zoom were going to be collaborating in the production side of things. It gave us a level of confidence. I must admit that level of confidence was uh, was tested at times because of some of the challenges that they were facing from both the organising committee and the host broadcaster. Um, but their resilience and uh, ability to push through in really trying circumstances has been outstanding. I think the production at the venues by Zoom has been um, world class. Um, had some very challenging uh, issues in the setup and operation at the venues. And I think the way that initially their staff have worked through those issues is a compliment to the company but also to all of the individuals who really went the extra mile to make sure that the coverage of the 2010 Commonwealth Games was as I say world class. There were times before the, the game started where we were seriously concerned about what the outcome may or may not be but um, in general we've been very happy with the superb coverage we've seen from a number of sports especially aquatics and some of the other sports um, throughout the games. A wonderful, wonderful exhibition of technology, production, logistics and overall television skills. I think, um, you know, from other games that we've been to, you know, with multi-sport coverage, you know, the games here have been uh, very good coverage. We've, we've been very happy. Uh, I think, again, I would say that, you know, there's been a lot of struggles that they've gone through. You know, we've missed... I think things like helicopters and some tests and things like that, but for the most part, uh, seeing the feeds that we're seeing on all the sports and knowing a lot of the broadcasters are, are contributing and working with Zoom that uh, you know the coverage is, is very good and, and we've been very happy with it.